Hello and welcome to Inkscape for Teachers. In this tutorial I'll be showing you how to draw a circle that's constrained to go through two given points or through three given points. So let's start with the two points. First of all ensure that snapping is turned on in particular snapped paths, intersections and cusp nodes. Then we'll start with the Bezier Pen Tool or B and click on the centre of the object, the other point, and then the second point click and enter. I should have mentioned to ensure that snap to circle to object centres is turned on up there. Back to the select tool, control D to duplicate and rotate that 90 degrees. We'll control drag and end, you can do that to either end of the line. And the centre of the circle that uh, goes through these two points must be along this line. So let's mark the centre, let's uh, copy a point there, control C and control V let's uh, put it here on, on the line. I'll give it a slightly different fill just to differentiate it as the centre. OK. Now, we'll mark a radius. So again, B for the Bezier Pen Tool. From the centre to either one of the points will be a radius. Click, click and enter. I'll make that uh, blue, shift blue. So that blue segment is the radius. Now if I control D to duplicate that, and drag it over here, I now have a diameter represented. Now uh, an interesting uh, function within Inkscape is if we use the ellipses tool over here or E and we start from a point on the circle and drag to another point on the circle while holding Control alt down we can get a circle through those two points. So let's start with uh, zoom in a little bit. You must have both points in view though. If I click there, click and Control alt and then drag. I can drag anywhere but the cursor to the end of the line till it snaps there and let go and I'll have, you can zoom out, a circle through those two points. I'll just uh, shift click or click the circle and shift click a blue and bump up the uh, uh, thickness of the stroke. Okay so there's a circle through two given points. Let's try it with uh, three points now. Busy A pen tool, and we click a segment, click, click and enter between any two points. Select tool, control D to duplicate, rotate 90 degrees. Back to the Busy A pen tool, now you can do any other two points, but let's do the second and third. Click, click, enter. Select tool, control D to duplicate, and rotate 90 degrees. Now those perpendicular bisectors don't intersect. You can click and control drag and end until they do. I don't have to do that one, but uh, maybe just shorten that. And that's the centre of our circle. I'll just uh, control C to copy that, control V, and drag it till it snaps and give it uh, a slightly different colour. That's the centre point. Okay, now once again we'll draw a radius from the centre to any point, click click enter and I'll shift click to make that red and there's our radius, the red red segment control D to duplicate, drag it down there till it snaps, now I've got a red diameter now I'll do what I did before, E for the ellipsis tool start in the at one point on the diameter control alt and drag down the cursor till it snaps to the other end, let go Back the select tool and there's our circle through three points. So I'll just uh, shift click that while selected and make that say 0.7 as well. So there's our constructions, there are our constructions for a circle through two points or through three points and that's quite precise. You could just uh, try this by trial and error with dragging ellipses out until you resize them and get them through the points but that uh, wouldn't be exact even if it looked exact it'd probably be a few pixels off and uh, when you resize you might get problems but this method is precise so I hope that's of some use to you and uh, as always thanks for watching